Ooh, make sure you do your push-ups, do your dips. You want to make sure you also get you some pull-ups in, guys. Pull-ups are difficult, okay? They're hard. And even for people who are who have been working out up to this point, uh, pull-ups are still a, a little bit of a challenge. Uh, but you do want to at least attempt to make sure you include them into your workouts. Uh, they're gonna work your your back, your your back, your upper lats, um, and just make sure you do them in good form and give us what you got, right? Like if you can, if you can only get a half a pull-up, that's fine. Give me that half a pull-up until you can get to one, right? And that and that's okay. But again, moving that body weight is crucial to making sure that you you're, you're, have a solid foundation in your fitness journey. Then you can start putting on the, the dumbbells and the, the, the barbells and the, the resistance bands and the weight vests. Yeah, trash bag. And all that all additional you know, equipment that you can use to, to then further chisel down your body into the form in which you want to get it. But body weight, make sure you can move your body. Right. And for those of you who don't know how important a pull-up is, it's the one exercise that literally can save your life. Literally. If you ever find yourself hanging off a ledge and you say, when do I hang off a ledge? I don't know, but this is <laughs> this is when you would need to be able to do a pull-up because literally no other exercise will help you but a pull-up if you're hanging off a ledge. Exactly. So I always make the joke, if you can't do a pull-up, then you can't. You just you, might you, die. You just might die. Because like, like, if you can do a whole bunch of push-ups, Go ahead and put go ahead, yeah. and, go ahead and push up off that cliff. <laughs> go ahead and push up off that cliff. That's gonna be it for you. But no, you know, obviously in general, improving your fitness, but a pull-up is very key. Just make sure you can do one.